Singapore handles outbreaks like COVID-19 through a color-coded framework known as the Disease Outbreak Response System Condition, or DORSCON for short. This framework serves as a general guideline on the preventive measures to take to reduce the impact of infections. DORSCON consists of four statuses, from mild to severe, and are represented by green, yellow, orange, and red. So what do the different colors indicate? Dorscon Green indicates that the disease is mild or severe, but does not spread easily from person to person. Travel advice and border screenings will be implemented. People are advised to stay home if feeling unwell, maintain good personal hygiene, and to look out for health advisories from local officials. Dorscon Yellow categorizes the disease in two different aspects. One, the disease is severe and spreads easily from person to person, but is outside of Singapore. Two, the disease is spreading in Singapore, but is contained, typically mild and slightly more severe than seasonal influenza. Apart from the implemented measures, there will be additional border control measures and healthcare facilities. Dorscon Orange marks the disease as severe and spreads easily from person to person, but is not widespreading and is contained within Singapore. The status increases disruptions as more measures like quarantines, temperature screenings, and hospital visitor restrictions will be imposed. Dorscon Red raises the nation's risk level to the peak where the disease is observed to be severe, fatal, and widespreading. To ensure public safety, schools will be closed and mandatory work from home orders will be in place. Social distancing is to be practiced in crowded places. With the Dorscon framework, Singapore is able to respond effectively during a pandemic.